In March, a milestone event occurred at the Savalmash construction site. For the first time, builders installed utilities inside the building of the Design and Technological Bureau. Water piping was laid to the fire safety rooms. Excavation work continued to lay other utilities, sewage and storm drains. Even more tasks were performed inside the building. Interior partitions were installed. Inside the production area and on the ground floor of the administration and utility building, the installation came to an end. Windows and doors between the rooms were installed. The installation of electrical power panels was performed. The trays for the cable channels were laid. The distribution of electricity and other engineering networks was fulfilled. The equipment was mounted, laser complex was set up, and the installation of equipment in the testing laboratory and other areas continued. Commissioning and other works began. In the warehouse part of the building, the installation of shelving for finished products and materials continued. In March, Sovelmash was featured in several Russian and foreign mass media. The reputable business magazine Business Excellence published a six-page article titled Doing of Motors, a project of its time. The publication describes in detail the advantages of technology Slavyanka and the history of its origin, practical application of the technology and, in particular, the cooperation of Sovelmash with its partners from China. The article also describes the construction of a design and technological bureau in Zelenograd and the crowding investment method of financing the project. The publication contains a blitz interview with Mitro Duyunov. TV channel Business 24, which is devoted to economy and business of Cote d'Ivoire, aired two reports about the project Duyunov's motors. The first one was about the opening of the Solo Group office. The second one was about the conference held in Abidjan. Journalists talked to top managers of the company, leading partners and participants of the events. The audience of the channel learned about Slavanka technology, unique electric motors, construction of the design and technological bureau Savalmash, and the possibility of becoming a co-owner of the enterprise. The website Zelenograd Info Portal mentioned the construction of the Design and Technological Bureau in a note about the plans of industrial construction in 2023. According to the media, a total of 16 industrial sites are being built in the Zelenograd district. Eight of them are planned to be commissioned this year, including the Design and Technological Bureau Savalmash. The inauguration of the Solar Group office in Cote d'Ivoire took place on the 2nd of March. The ceremony was held in Abidjan with the personal participation of top managers of Sol Group, Pavel Shatsky, commercial director, and Pavel Filipov, head of advertising and public relations, as well as the head of the production cooperation resource Andrei Lobov, who held a demonstration of electric motors based on Slavanka technology. The office opening was attended by the national representative of Sol Group in Cote d'Ivoire and a number of other countries, Julie Weber, the company's leading partners and investors in the project, about 40 guests in total. The office regularly hosts project presentations, meetings of partners, as well as demonstrations of electric motors based on Slavanka technology. This is the third office of Solar Group in Africa. The previous ones were opened in Benin and Nigeria. On the 4th of March, the largest Solar Group conference for Africa in the history of the project was held in Abidjan. More than 400 guests attended, not only from Côte d'Ivoire, but also from Cameroon, Benin, Senegal, Burkina Faso, Lebanon, Great Britain, Canada. The speakers were the same people who had opened the company's office two days earlier. Participants of the event learned the most up-to-date information about the project and construction of the Design and Technological Bureau, got answers to their questions from the top figures, and saw the motors based on Slavanka technology. All this helped them believe in the project, better understand its essence and advantages, and make a decision to invest. It is now possible to buy a share of Sovelmash for children in the Solar Group back office. To do this, an investor needs to register a special children's package. These are investment packages of the same denomination and discount as the standard ones, except that they are not issued in the name of the investor, but in the name of his or her child. The parent pays for the entire package, and when the child comes of age and is verified in his or her back office, the shares will be registered in his or her ownership. You can buy several children's packages for one or more children. You can buy a package for a child and learn more about this possibility in your back office, section Investments, tab Packages for Children.
we have improved the verification procedure in the back office and prepared instructions for it, so that it would be clearer and more convenient for you to be verified. These innovations reduce the probability of mistakes and will help you pass the verification at the first attempt. Now filling the form is divided into simple steps. There is a description and detailed instructions for each step, according to which you should fill in the form and upload the images. We remind you that verification in the back office is necessary to document the ownership of investment shares. We have expanded the possibilities of replenishing the main account in the back office. Digital payment system Xeon became available to investors. With its help, the account can be replenished with four types of coins. The payment system Xeon is characterized by the absence of commission, instant receipt of funds, and the fact that you can top up your account from $1. Follow our news and keep up to date with the development of the project.